Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If this is your first time with me, then hello, my name is Kimberly and welcome to my little corner of YouTube. Today I'm going to be reviewing with you the Wanda Beauty Baggage Claim Golden Eye Mask. Now this is an eye mask that I received in one of my BoxyCharms. I'm going to go ahead and review it for you. Um, I've seen a lot of hype on these masks. Um, I'm not really into like the lip mask or the eye mask. I'm barely starting to get into face masks. Um, I'm not really sure. I question if these are just a gimmicky, if it's just a fad that's going on right now. But does it really work? Mm, I don't know. I am very skeptical. But we're going to go ahead and try it and I'll let you know. So I've already scrubbed my face and I went ahead and cleansed it with the Forero scrub that I have here. I just did a review on it. I'm going to go ahead and put in the link below so this way you can go ahead and check it out if you want to see that video. The next step is the eye mask. Now I've heard a lot of on reviews that if you put it in the freezer then and you apply it it would decrease the puffiness but I've done a lot of research on this and these are gold foil. So the foil, what the reason for the foil is that when you put it on it creates heat within your skin which the heat then draws all the serum from the mask onto your face. So the re there's a reason for the heat. So I did put it in the freezer just to say, hey, I had a couple of, of them. I'll try one and use it frozen or in the refrigerator and cold. But by the time I clicked record on this video, because of the foil, it it's no longer cold. And it was really cold. So I'm not sure if on these ones that would work, but I'm still going to go ahead and use them. But it's not even cold anymore, so I would say don't even bother. It says it's individually packaged gold foil eye mask to brighten, hydrate, and reduce the appearance of dark circles. Experience three innovative layers of luxury. The gold helps retain heat, which is why it didn't stay cold, allowing the maximum amount of serum to penetrate the skin. The middle layer is an elastic allowing the mask to stick better to the skin. And third is a cellular fiber that condenses and delivers eye ingredients effectively, giving you all the skin loving benefits you need. So we're gonna go ahead and try it and let you know what I think. They are pricey. I don't remember the price off the top of my head, but I'll go ahead and put it right here for you. Is it worth the amount or is it better just to buy the eye serums and apply them? This is how it comes out it's in this little plastic. And they are evenly shaped so it doesn't matter what eye it goes on. And they're large because it's supposed to cover your full under eye and up to over your crow's feet giving you um, the full benefit of the area that you need targeted. So we're going to go ahead and take this out. So I'm take it really high and it does stick. So there you go, and they're sticking fine. I don't feel like they're gonna slide off. I did do a review on a lip mask, and that was really difficult. It felt like it kept snipping, so I had to stay with my neck up. If you're interested in that video, I'll go ahead and link that in the description as well, and maybe in the cards for you. So there's not too much serum left in there. But there is a little bit, so another trick that was recommended by BoxyCharm is that maybe tomorrow or the next day I can go ahead and save this serum and then apply it with my fingers um, under on my eye throughout the week until I apply another mask because this is recommended to use at least once a week. Now, I'm a girl who does not like to waste anything, so I'm totally for that you're gonna see me using this the rest of the week and maybe by doing that throughout the week you're gonna have um, better results in the end. I'm supposed to keep this on for 15 minutes I have about 12 minutes left so I'm gonna go ahead and lay down catch up on some Netflix and I'll be right back. 
So before I take off the mask, I do have a few more minutes. I'm just going to go ahead and apply my moisturizer on. And then I'm going to go ahead and apply my Advanced Night Repair Serum from Estee Lauder. I'm going to go ahead and let that dry and that just kills time till I'm ready for my eye mask, which I am ready now. So I'm going to go ahead and take them off. So it does feel very moisturizing on my eyes. It does feel really good and relaxing while I was laying down watching Netflix. Um, it was kind of like a spa day at home. So that's always fun. But as far as any long-term results or any results at all, I would have to probably try this a couple more times. So I'm going to go ahead and use the serum that's left in the package throughout the week. And then at the end of the week, I'm going to go ahead and... I have two more packs, so I'm gonna go ahead and do another eye mask and then do the same thing, repeat it, use the serum throughout the week, another eye mask, just, just so I can see if there's any change, any results, and get be able to give a good full review. I'll let you know either it'll be in my I love it or I hate it video at the end of the month. So let me know what you think. Have you tried the mask? Do you like them? What do you think about masks in general? Do you think it's very gimmicky? Is it a waste of money? Let me know in the comments below what you think. And remember, you're beautiful, you're amazing, you're a blessing, and don't let anybody tell you any different. As always, I love you and have a wonderful day.